Greetings and salutations to all you folks out there. We're diving into another mission in Dawn of War 2. This is going to be on the planet Typhon, and as you can see, our Tyranid Infense Station is at astronomical heights, but I don't think we're going to be fighting Tyranids. We're going after some orcs. We're going to be looking for the Tech Priest camp, protecting it from the orc invasion, and hopefully finding ourselves a super weapon. So let's go ahead and dive into here, see what it has to offer. We have located the Tech Priest base camp but it is in grave danger. An orc mob is heading straight for their location. These greenskins have just cut a swath through several small communities and outposts. Their leader calls himself Gorwaza, and he commands from a powerful looted tank. We cannot let the orcs reach the Tech Priest base camp. If the Tech Priests are killed, we may never find the Astronomic Array. Stop Gorwaza before he gets to the base camp. All right, so good thing we have some uh, good thing we have some anti-vehicle weaponry because apparently we're going to be taking on at least one tank, maybe more. That is a beautiful, beautiful picture. Warhammer striking an orc, nothing better. <laughs> I don't know, maybe we will see Tyranids. I have no idea how this works, because apparently if the infestation level is high enough, that means you face a bunch of Tyranids, but I'm not entirely sure that that affects a stated goal of going versus the Orcs. It's probably going to be something to do with the uh, optional missions a little bit later on. And dropship! Commander, you must hurry. Gorwaza is already at the base camp. I have marked its position on your display. Quickly, before we are too late. Alrighty then. What am I supposed to get off to? Enemy located. Hello! I would like to kill you all, thank you very much. Hey, you guys. Let's throw some C4 on that building, why don't we? And you, it's power armor, that son of a gun. Oh, never mind. You're already gone. <laughs> All right, we've got to get back in the hang of this thing. Do need to pick up a couple of items. We need to suppress some orcs. Let's stealth and run up to the front here and see if we can land a shotgun blast on this whole mess. Walk up, walk up. Shotgun in the face. Not quite a one-hit kill, but hey, it's nice. We want to save our thermal bombs for the, or the melt bomb for the one further on. Let's head up with the commander here. Please shoot. Thank you very much. And explosives. You know, every situation can be made better with explosives. Every single one. I kid you not. You need to build a building? Explosives. It can actually do it. Why are you trying to pile on top of me? There we go. Trying to pile on top of me while I'm trying to reinforce my troops. It seems a little weird, but then again, you might just, might just want me to not slaughter you all. Okay, so all of you are good. Let's dive bomb right in the middle. <laughs> that is one of my favorite moves of all times. Ah, we have ourselves a ribbon. Always want those fashion accessories for your war games. Everybody knows it's all about the armor. And that is a mech. Please back up. Please back up now because I do not want to lose you. Thank you very much. All right, everyone focus fire. And you guys, let's see what the Power Fist does to this. Kaboom! Pick the whole dang Jeep up off the ground. <laughs> We're going to jump in behind. That buzzsaw is brutal. Oh, good lord. It actually one-hit KOs. Oh, my. Not cool. Run, Cirrus. Run! I would like you to power fist him in the face. 
Merciless Strike! That's the name of that move. I should probably not call it Power Fist. Sounds like something that you would find in questionable places on the internet. Power in. Hit again. And go after the big guy. <laughs> you guys need to move up. We need some suppressive fire. That is for sure. Shall we explosive shotgun? We have a few extras. Yeah. I would like you to attack, please. Thank you very much. Let's heal up. Nobody's in the building, so we should be good there. Oh, good lord. Run away! Cluster mines. Please, why? Okay, there we go. They triggered that time. Good freaking deal. I should remember to use those more often because if I am using the cluster mines, that thing walks so slowly. I should have no problem whatsoever getting that together. Alright, you guys need to focus fire. Let him heal. There we go. I love that jump thrust that that guy does. It's freaking brutal. Okay, you need to back up. You're about to be dead. We got to heal. Yes, we do. C4. And no more skull face. <laughs> Bring the whole mountainside down. Why not? Why not? Okay, let's do this a little, let's pull some strategy here. I'm going to cloak up, I'm going to run up, we're going to drop some mines here. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. They spot me with the explosives? That's okay. Oh well. Run away, run away, run away, there's the mines. That worked, that worked out very, very well. Bazooka just about one hit KO'd the truck after that mine took effect. Alright, so I've stealthed again. He's not really paying attention to me. And three for one. Nope. Yep, there it is. Good deal. What happens if I power fist a building? It actually kills the people inside the building. I did not know that. That is beautiful. Wow, you're the only one that I have a full squad left in. Focus fire! Doesn't that increase my range? I think it does. Alright, while well, everybody's distracted, let's get up here. Wee! Stand on top of the bomb. Stand on top of the bomb, why don't you? There you go! It's always better off for me when that happens. Let's power fist this building. And he's suppressed. Why does this always happen at the least opportune moments? Because it does. Okay. Run up. Let's hit this. What is this one? Um, become immune to knockback. That is a good thing. That's the one I was looking for. Blessed, f Blessing of fortitude. I need to remember that I have that because there are various opportunities where being invincible would be just such a huge help to things. Alright. You need to get up here because you need to mercilessly strike these guys. There we go. One hit KO on the orcs. Got to keep that ability in rotation. Good lord. Oh, get away from the grenade. Get away from the grenade. Please. Thank you. What do we got left? We have an explosive shotgun. Yes. Have a merciless strike. Yes. There we go. Just need one more hit there. Yep. 
There it is. And we are finally almost up to this. Um, let me see. Let's stealth. And... Mines. hey -o. Follow me, please. Thank you. <laughs> nice. Alright, let's get everybody around the corner. He's taking the jeep around the other way, so... It's good for us. I would like to get some more support items, please, and thank you, and fire will. Let's mercilessly strike these sons of guns. hey -o. Body Body parts flying everywhere is a good sign when you're fighting the orcs. That is... For sure. I would appreciate you rushing the truck. Does it flip the truck? Oh, that's disappointing. I would love it if it actually flipped the truck up. Okay, so we've got those guys down there. They're not going to be any bother. Let's strike him out of the sky. Oh, no! Freaking missile launcher preempted it. Thank you very much. Do not come again. Alright, let's get everybody reinforced. And then we're going to head on in to the final battle up here. Objective. Probably going to end up being a defensive mission, but uh, we can deal with that. All right, gonna reinforce everybody. There it is, three and three and three, and squad leader. Let's get that consumable up. Hey, look. Oh, stealths. Why are there stealth orcs? Aren't regular orcs bad enough? Get over there. You need to be over there, not over here. On the wrong freaking side of the strangely carnivorous looking plants. I love how far that shockwave goes. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. You're just going to rip into shreds with the saws? There we go. You'd think that orcs would die faster when there's a bunch of chainsaws. Rut row. We have a death tank. Oh, good lord. Oh, good lord. Oh, okay, I see how it goes. Alright, well, let's throw some C4 out. Let's throw a melt bomb Let's call in an artillery strike, why don't we? Hello! Thank you very much, please come again. I would like to kill you all. Heal them up, keep everybody from dying. Long as we can, long as we can. Let's go explosive shot you. And strike. Um, get out of the way, get out of the way. Alright, let's get the bomb back out. Get the bomb back out. Run away, run away, run away. Oh wow, he takes all of the cover out with him. That is very strong. Hit him up, hit him up, hit him up. Shotgun blast as well, please. Thank you. Get out, get out, get out. Oh, good lord. Let's make everyone immune for a time, shall we? And shotgun blast you, sons of guns. Let's get a melt -a bomb on him. Get another heal out. Ah, we just need a little more. Just need a little more. One more power fist. Let's get one more artillery strike. Oh crap, he canceled his movement that way. 
Get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way. One more bomb, we're done. There it is. Hello. Well, of course you felt it. Freaking straight up demolished your face. Alright, well. Is it technically a success then? Mission complete, mission success. And we got the Relic Flamer. Well, poor marks all the way around, but at least we got through it. Are we going to get a level up? Nope. Oh well, we can burn through a little bit of war gear and maybe generate ourselves a level up. This Those ships look like they have angry stuff. eyebrows. We cannot stop the Tyranids without the scans from the Astronomic Array. Do we have any leads on what happened to the Tech Priest reports? It seems the Array has attracted the attention of an orc named Ripa Splitter. He has stolen the data slate, giving the Array's location, and vanished into the deep jungle. Do we have Ripa Splitter's location? Not yet, but we have found one of his lieutenants. I am uploading his last known position to your map display. Find and eliminate that orc, Commander. We cannot let him escape. All right, so we're going on an orc hunt later on. Looks like we'll be needing that. Okay, Cirrus, what kind of shotgun do you have? Level 12 shotgun, which means we probably do not need this level 11 shotgun. Wait, why does the 11 have more damage than the level 12? Fire rate's the same. This has more range and higher damage. That's very weird. Oh, requires no or no level requirement and this one requires level 11. Okay, well that makes sense. I'll hang on to him a little bit longer. You have lower damage. I'm going to recycle you. Probably want to hang on to the flamer. Yes, I'm not going to use it at this particular moment, but I'll keep it around. Okay, so you look good. You look good. Uh, could probably... Yes, we definitely need to replace that. Holy cow, level 5. How do we mess that one up? Got another level 10 and another level 9 there. Minus 10 accuracy is definitely not something that I'm too terribly enthused about. And you, stalwart blade of champions, and we have the iron fist. Can I equip it? I cannot. It is either sword or gauntlet, not both. And the sword currently that we're equipped with does 42 damage as opposed to 47 vehicles 75 percent so the power fist is better in every single way i'm gonna go with that the sword looks totally badass but we're just gonna go for punching things in the face with a violence unheard of before warhammer 40,000. all right that's gonna set us up for the next mission as always thank you so much for watching i'll catch you guys in the next one